Falcon is 33. Half on clock will hold at FEMA 31 seconds due to a failure. We've had a hold. We do not know at this time what the problem is. We'll be standing by for a word, but the clock is holding at T minus 31 seconds due to a system failure. The LO2 outboard filling drain valve. NTD is CMPL. Go ahead. That's uh, LCC MPS 8. And uh, PV9 outboard filling drain closed power is off. It should be on. NTD is CMPS. Uh, the valve's closed. We'll go. Okay, you have a go to proceed. Uh, GLS, pick up the count immediately. I copy. Mark. GLS, let's go for auto sequence start. We are go for start. 25. Booster hydraulic power units have started. 20. Sound suppression water system has started. 15. T minus 13 seconds. T minus 10, go for main engine start. We are go for main engine start. T minus 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery with the Hubble Space Telescope, our window on the universe. Mission Control Houston. Hold all program. Roger roll, Discovery. The roll maneuver puts the vehicle in the proper launch plane. Guidance officer confirms a good roll maneuver. Engines now throttling back. The throttle down maneuver assists in reducing the aerodynamic loads on Discovery as it passes through the area of not maximum dynamic pressure. Velocity now 1,200 feet per second. Discovery downrange three nautical miles. Discovery, go with throttle up. All three engines now throttle back up. Go with throttle up. Engines at 104 percent. The go at throttle up call signifies that all systems are performing well. All three auxiliary power units look good. Discovery's velocity now 2,300 feet per second and is downrange 8 nautical miles. Standing by for SRB separation. And both solid rocket boosters have separated. Discovery's velocity now 4,300 feet per second at a downrange distance of 35 nautical miles. Booster officer reports all three engines stable at 104% performance. Discovery Houston, performance is nominal. And Discovery two-engine Ben Gurir. The two-engine Ben Gurir call means that uh, Discovery could reach the transatlantic abort site at Ben Gurir on two engines if it were necessary. Copy nominal performance, two-engine Ben. And Discovery is on the glide slope, converging on the center line. Coming up uh, now for the pre-flare maneuver at uh, 2,500 feet. Current altitude about 6,800 feet.
Landing gear is down and locked. Main gear touchdown. Nose gear touchdown. Discovery rolls out on runway 22 at Edwards at the end of uh, mission STS-31 after traveling 2,068,213 statute miles on this mission. Mechanical systems officer reports steady braking. The normal amount of braking is about 8 to 10 feet per second. And uh, this detail test objective today is designed to be a light braking or low energy braking to try out the new carbon brakes. Wheel stop. Houston Discovery, wheel stop. Roger that, Discovery. Welcome back. Congratulations on a super mission. And the world is looking forward to reaping the benefits of your good work over the next 15 years. Welcome back, guys, and we have no post-landing deltas. Okay, thank you, Steve, and uh, we sure uh, enjoyed it also. It was great fun. It sure looked like it.